My name is Anna Tai. I work in the Advanced Technology Centre in Rolls Royce. I've been working in the aerospace industry for nine years now, and now I work as a repair technology manager. I examine parts that's been in the engine um, and look at ways on how to save it. For example, if the part has been worn due to service, we look at uh, if there's a current possible way repairable or shop floor to repair them. If there isn't, we'll develop techniques or methods on putting it back into service and introduce it back to the network. First, we examine the part and look under the microscope of the part in detail. Then I like to hold it in my hands. It's amazing to think about this part has been in the plane for 10,000 hours, for example, and then that helps me to think about how I can repair it. Next, we'll gather the team of repair technologies and brainstorm the idea. At this stage, we do not censor out the ideas, but we remain open-minded. Then we look at the list and go into more detailed possible ways of repairing it. We don't do this alone. We tap into our great global network of universities and the research network across the region. For example, in Singapore, we work with ASTAR and the universities to make our research process richer. I first started my career in the semiconductor industry and now I work with the most complex pieces of technology in the aerospace industry. At Rolls-Royce, we are exploring advanced tools and technologies such as robotics, automation and additive manufacturing to help us carry out certain tasks. Powering a plane is a complex engineering feat which requires effort, skills and collaboration. Not many companies can make a jet engine. It is nice to feel that I'm part of the team that brings people to see their family or to bring them to the next vacation. That's a privilege.